You ready? Hey, listen. Get some. Good evening, everybody. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Lawrence's Let's Plays. This is Moon Scars Part 2. To my returning viewers, thanks so much for your continued support. If you are brand new to the channel, thank you as well for stopping by. Guys, do consider to give a thumbs up if you're enjoying the content. Also, leave comments to let me know what you enjoy about this series thus far. And also, consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't already to join the Lawrence's Legends crew over here at Lawrence's Let's Plays. With that being said, I just want to take a moment to shout out the newest member to the crew, Retro Plays Games. My friend, thank you so much for your sub. You just got me to double sevens, baby. To me, hey, that's lucky times two. Can we get to 100, guys and gals? I know we can get it. We're getting close. We'll get there. Appreciate the hell out of each and every one of you guys. Thank you so much. Nothing really left to say other than I'm Lawrence. Let's play. Uh, load from the lower slums. Make sure you guys check the previous video uh, to find out more about the gameplay mechanics and all that good stuff. But uh, we're going to pick up where we left off from here. And we are going to... Oh, with the parry, though. I don't know about my skills, son. Alright, so we're going to be smart. And we're going to go ahead and go into our witchery. Let's buy some stuff, guys. And gals. Uh, Great Irma damages and pushes away nearby foes. Seismic explosion. I like it. I don't know if I like it all that much right now, though. Great Irma shoots a stone projectile. Simple, but steady. Excuse me, Irma's attacks temporarily become poisonous. Mm. Mm. Can we get level 2 of this? A blast directed forward, burst 2. Let's get it. Learn spells at dark mirrors. What? Oh, that's right. I'm so stupid. You do have to go to a dark mirror for that. Duh. Okay. Let's try it again. Yep. Learn. We're going to learn spell... Boy, I don't know. What do you guys think? Maybe this one? Great Irma damages and pushes away nearby foes. Sounds kind of nice. I'm kind of feeling level 2 on this uh, burst, though. Let's get that. And then we unlock something else. Great Irma explodes all corpses in sight. Level 3, 8,000. Yikes. Great Irma conjures a destructive stone wave moving upwards. I'm liking the sound of that. But for now, look, we're good. Spent a little. We upgraded our blast to level two. We're gonna kick this guy's ass. You don't want none awards? Come on now. This is called Lawrence's Let's Plays, my man. Not Lawrence sucks at moon scars. Shit. Ah, you're so dumb. You got a hit in on me, though. Good job. Oh, you know I'm about to do it. Bow! Hit him with that level two, baby. What you know about that level two, son? Scary. I'm not scared of you clay spiders. Whatever the hell you are. You're dead, I know that. Oh, that's gonna hurt! Every special weapon has a unique build-up to inflict on foes. Use it to your advantage. Got some more hidden bone powder. I know I missed that last episode. When I went back and uh, was scrubbing through my footage, I was like, ah, oh, I absolutely missed that shit. And no one even told me. Could have left a comment and let me know, guys. You're letting me down. Don't let me down. Clay templates contain slumbering foes that may wake up at any moment. Corrupt templates with Icor 
and spawn Claiborne's on your side. Let's get it. Look at that. Fight, my minion. Oh, you're done, bro. And you're dead. Look at that. Glowing wall. You know what we do with glowing walls? Bow, baby! Bone powder hiding from me. Hide no more, bone powder. Ow, it hurt, bro. Stop that. Get wrecked! Like I said, parries are so good, guys. Parries are the shit. Come on, punk. Hey, 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 shut up. Shut your face. I hate them little bastards. Oh. Try it again. I dare you. Oh, never mind. I don't dare you. Some health back. Let's try this again. And all of a sudden, I forgot how to damn do the uh, parry all of a sudden. Yeah, Rick. Every one of you, line up and get your monkey asses kicked. Come on, punk. Surprise! <laughs> you big dummy. You big dummy! Y'all saw that, right? That was so obvious. So obvious. A place that had something hidden. But I missed. We'll try again. Oh no! Gotcha. Picked up a gland. Oh yeah. I got no juice. I got some no juice. Gotta get my icor built back up. Get rizzed. Ow. Oh, I'm dead. Lawrence, what are you doing? Looking foolish. Moon hunger to the moon. Oh, the mold perished and the time has passed. The moon has grown hungry. Toughening the Claiborne's. Note, performing Moonrite at a dark mirror eases her hunger. This is what I was talking about. Moon hunger inflicted. So now all the enemies are going to be tougher. I'm not sure if it takes more hits for you to kill them. I just know that they are going to kick your ass way quicker. Come over here, dummy. Stalling on you. You don't know what I'm doing. Can't even find me, son. Here I am. I mean, look at the damage that I've already sustained. The dude like hit me one time. Get her. Woo! Spite level achieved. What we got? Which cost minus ten percent it is. We'll get it. Come on, bro. Woo! Whew, that's some health, bro. Get your ass, bitch. Yeah. That's going to be a no. I'm not messing with them stupid things right now. No way, no sir, no how. We'll go back and get 
her body. Like a lot of naughty because she likes the body. Yeah. Shenanigans, bro. Shenanigans. Oh, shit. Then we're done. <laughs> Whoopsies. Poor bitch. You're next. Come on, come on, clown. Shit. So stupid, bro. You're awfully stupid, my man. Yo, where's my damn body? I'm totally not in the right place. What the hell was I thinking? Oh, shit. What am I doing? Just gonna jump right into the spikes. Yeah, we're gonna go back here. Safe side. We're gonna be on the safe side. Get all our shit back. We're gonna get all our shit back. Because we're not gonna rest for a while at a dark mirror. Let's do the clay right. Oh, snap. Okay, so that answered my questions. I had a question in the previous episode or previous part of this walkthrough. Be sure to check that out. Um, as to how it says, Quay right bonus applies until interacting with the next dark mirror. I didn't know if it meant the next time you interact with any dark mirror, like this one that I'm currently at. But no, apparently it's the very next one you get to. Okay. So I actually still have that active. Nice. Plus 5% gland drop rate. Uh, I think we're good where we're at. And I'll keep the moon. I'll keep the moon right going on here. Sure. Why not? I'll be risky. Why not? I'm trying to get more of this. More of this resource that I need. Bone powder. Now when I use that one. Because that's the one I've not used yet. That's when it will uh, take my bonus away. Get your ass over there. Get my shit back with skills, baby. With the skills. Alright, so... No. Get him, my little minion. Oh. Good job. Take care of him, minion. Oh, shit. Minion, you gotta do better than that. Oh, I got that. Okay. weird I guess if you don't get that parry just right you can still like parry but you don't get the the full effect like I did where it's like the the power slash too this one right here it's pretty wild I got some help get him little minion oh man 
minions turn some shit up, guys. He ain't playing around. You're dead. Stay down, bitch. To link this dark mirror to the workshop, this mold will be discarded forever. Oh, no. So we're going to do that. Doppel ganger begotten the doppelganger it's awakened dark eye core boils you cast away your mold but it refused to vanish the void inside you growing bigger good as if somebody took your face and your powers too ha go find it take back what's yours yes kill it prey upon your reflection or it will prey upon you irma ha ha don't laugh at me bitch after sacrifice, Grey Irma loses a special attack and her discarded mold turns into a vile doppelganger. Return to the last mirror and take back your special attack. Ah. I'm gonna take my special attack, huh? I bet your ass don't. I bet your ass don't! Get some of this. So it is true, my shadow came after me. I have what you had. I am you. No, you're not. You are just a forsaken chunk of clay. It's a lie, we both know it. I'll show you what I know. Uh, that I missed you with that attack, for one. That kind of sucked. It's not what I meant to do. Whoa, you got that attack too, huh? Well, yeah, because you're me. Get wrecked, bitch. Stand no chance against Lawrence! Mirror key. The doppelganger stole this key from the space within Dark Mirror. Yelza. Ah! Why does my gland hurt? I've killed that thing already. You lost something important, Grey Kitten. Don't you remember? Your eye core got thin and weak. Tainted, just like mine. Every time you cast a mold, you pour yourself inside the clay. Your eye core imbues dry shell, makes it rise and stand on its own, a vessel of free will. Mm, excuse me. And that's how your eye core leaves the body. That is how it avoids stagnation. Now it calls for you from the skin that you shed and the shell that you rejected. Stray Icor commands you to kill what once was you. With every boy it returns to you, drop by drop, altered, restored, radiant again. Nonsense! That chunk of hatred cannot... When we reject something, we make ourselves incomplete. Thus, we all hate what we need the most. I don't... Discover special weapon, baby. Oh, it's gonna make me switch. Uh, oh no, World 1, I still got World 1. I get no bonus, but that hammer just looks too slow. Uh, what's it do? Build up a stun, that's kind of nice. Wither with the... Ooh. Big long ass spear. The thing is, like, when I fight another doppelganger, I don't want to fight one that also has that ability. So, yeah, we're going to stick with Whirlwind. Quite a fan of Whirlwind. You guys say cat, cat not in the hat. Caesar and Grey Kitten finally embraced her shadow. Things that she lacks, they return to her with the doppelgangers. Violent, deadly things indeed. She struggles to recollect herself, yet instead she changes irreversibly. Every time she finds inside something new, what will the new Grey Irma be like, Zoran? I ask myself this over and over. Right. Bum, 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 bum. She had said I got a key for the inside the dark mirror, right? Said I got a key inside the dark mirror. So let's go over here. Let's see what you gotta say. Anything new? I'm having them, cat. The mistress's wrath makes this husk of yours hungry, Zoran. 
I wonder if your gray kitten will try our best to feed him this time. Oh, hey! Exchange with the first one. So, you can purchase stuff with your bone powder with him. Oh. Clay templates explode after interaction instead of spawn. Clay explosion gemstone. Price is 2000 I have enough. We got 3354 Statue gemstone. Bone powder uh, costs 3000 Irma receives less damage but moves and attacks slower. Yeah, I'm not about that. Healing Trance Bonestone uh, makes Irma invulnerable during healing. Bonestone is nothing else than a bone powder cookie. Traditional burial gifts a celestial mistress. This tree is supposed to ingratiate the deceased one to her. Leftovers remain upon Irma's death. Tell you what, I'm kind of liking that. Uh, Retribution Gemstone partially returns received damage back to foes. Leech gemstone, successful parry, restores a portion of Irma's health. Hello, let's get that. Uh, 8,000 bone powder. I'm away from getting that, but I want that, for sure. Hexed special weapon gemstone, 10,000 cost. Increases weapon, special weapon damage at the cost of maximum health. Uh, no. I like that special weapon, or the option for a special weapon, which I'm using the whirlwind now, but I don't use it that often to uh, use something like that. I guess eventually you get a cell shift to him. Cool. I dig it. What you got to say, cat? What happened to the pristines, cat? My comrades, Chakra and Wanda, Laos. The mister snatched them with her claws. Are they dead? Yes and no. Ozorn, why is she asking me all this? You loved Claiborne pristines more than humans, and your love condemned them. Tell me what happened. I need to know. You see, hunters became the prey. To her, you were just a herd. She was about to shear. You should know this better than anybody, Grey Kitten. Okay. I read this shit right. Some creatures that Grey Irma encounters may provide goods to exchange. Got it. I did read this before, right? No, I didn't. Uh, if you interrupt your special attack with Dash right before the strike, Grey Irma will continue the attack immediately after. Right. I know. Uh, I can tell you what we're shooting for. For certain, with this guy, is I want to buy that bad boy right there. Leech Gemstone. Successful parry restores a portion of Irma's health. I like that a lot. What's up, Gargoyle? What do you guys say? She speaks to us. She sings to us the greatest lullaby. No, no, the other one. Avert your eyes from the sky. Hear the voices of the roots. Is this the key I needed? It is not. If sub sublunary world guess I'm saying that right seems too hostile check the moon's condition a pleased moon will make your way easier a pleased moon meaning when the moon is gray not blood red gifts of moon hunger when she is hungry bones grind into powder easier use moon hunger to collect more bone powder and find things concealed by gentle moonlight yeah. Oh, we're out of here. Yo! What the hell, game? The game just walked up on me, guys. It just freaking glitched out. It froze. That ain't cool. Don't do that, game. All right, cool. All right, we're good. Mm, excuse me. Back into the fight. Let's go. Ooh. 
think we're gonna keep this double bonus thing up still because uh yeah i'm all about that uh buying that thing from him to increase my shit life not my shit life but to, you know what i mean to increase my uh to increase my stuff i'm all about that life i need that in my life Heal every time I parry, which is a mechanic that I use quite frequently. Uh, yes, boys. Oh, I hit you both at once. Beat your ass into the invisible wall, son. Breakable wall, whatever. Let's go. Oh, nice. I was able to hit that jackass flying thing at the same time. Beautiful. Oh shit. Haha, I got some help. Ah, you old punk. You dead. You dead. That's what I said. You did. Oh my god, give me some shit. Damn, I killed myself running into the spikes. I'm as dumb as the enemies. The hell am I doing? That's fine. Oh my god. Damn. Pay attention, Lawrence. What are you doing? Bro, I need you to stop that shit. Like, yeah, we like stopped that shit, thanks. Come on, buddy. Get my shit here. Come on, bitch. You're done. That was a very warrants move of you to do. <laughs> Just running your ass into the spikes, dummy. That's right, you get your ass down there. You get down there where you belong, son. The combo, though. The wreck, bitch. I found Outskirt Roof Key, a part of Outskirt's rooftops, was precautiously walked by local moon priests. Sadly, this couldn't have stopped winged claybornes. Okay. Open says me. Get your ass back, buddy. Surprise. Bro, how did you even hit me? Correct. My bitch.
believe we've got the key now that we needed. We do. So we're gonna go over here. Oh, new enemy type. Like the other anno annoying flying guys, but these guys have spears. Koi tempered maximum. Icor permanently increased. Let's get it. We'll take it. Now I got three bars uh, on my maximum Icor there. Gray bar above my red health bar. Nice. I found ravenous spawn gemstone. Always spawn ravenous claymores after interaction with Koi template. Yeah. I don't know if I like that. I'm being honest, I don't know about that. I don't know about that one. Edelag, master look, she is sheltering herself in a husk. Her new icor gland is made of clay, has no cracks. Yet. Indeed, easy way to avert the loss. Don't you dare give this mold any liberties, else it will it will turn against you. Say, master, I told her what you wanted me to. See, master, I told her what you wanted me to. Yet she just won't listen to some old cat. to the last second to get that to work. Ow. Oh shit, I'm getting wrecked. Wow, that's a lot of them. Step back, bitch. Man, am I ever going to get that timing right? 100% about to get wrecked! Psych, come on out, you know better than that. You know, I'm too, too good for these fools. Hey, bro, step back. More icor, or I mean, more bone powder for me, baby. Good night. Bye bye. Uh, yep. So, guys, I think this is a fantastic place to wrap up. I uh, just wanted to say, uh, just in recap, kind of what we did. We did get two more keys. We used one in this area we're in, the outskirts uh, area that we're in right now. Um, there is another key that we got. It says that it's used behind a dark mirror, so we're going to have to. Go back and explore this map and see uh, what the key uh, or what door um, needs to be unlocked with that key. Um, we also uh, was able to show you the blood moon mechanic that I referred to in the first episode or first part, whatever. Um, and also like you know how that works and how the enemies get much stronger, yada yada. Um, also, uh, I showed you how you have to fight a doppelganger version of yourself whenever you break the koi mold thing or whatever. Um, that I believe does happen periodically throughout the game and they like steal your weapon and you got to get it back or something So pretty cool. Uh, we made a little bit of progress to open up the map some more uh, Showed off those gameplay mechanics. So we'll pick up where we left off here in uh, part three Which will be coming to you guys real soon once again. Thanks so much to everyone for getting on board um, Supporting my channel. We're so close to pushing a hundred subs man I, I appreciate each and every one of you guys for getting involved and for leaving comments on my videos and the different series I've done uh, big shout out to the newest member of Lawrence's Legends once again. Thank you so much, Retro Plays Games. I got nothing left to say. My name's Lawrence from Lawrence's Let's Plays, and I am out of here. Take care, everybody. See you real soon.